this was a, it was a tableau that Nick made that was kind of a potpourri. It had many themes, but Fortuna, uh, the goddess of wealth, and Neptune uh, used to be major parts of this tableau. And you can see the top of Net Neptune over there. Fortuna, unfortunately, is long gone. Uh, but she used to be up here. And then you can see a mermaid and a clown, a book reader over there. This is a fisherman uh, and an owl. And all these were parts of different tableaus that Nick would build. And uh, as they fell down, he would use the parts and rebuild it into something uh, else. And, and the, what you see here was the last iteration before Nick moved away. Nick and Catherine moved here in the 20s. They had just got married, needed a place to go uh, for a honeymoon. And Nick fell in love with this place, probably because it was so much like his native Austria. And uh, being the kind of guy he was, he, uh, he had to do more than just dairy farm and make cheese. And so he would start going out into the shed and no one could follow. And he would build something. And when it was done, he'd bring it out and plant it in the yard. And statue after statue after statue. And he did this from 1937 to 1962, when he just got too old to be able to work in concrete anymore. And uh, they sold the place, and he packed up and moved with his daughter uh, to Maryland. Uh, and it's been part of our legacy and history since then. Tell me about his painting, what he did after that. that he, started he did his, uh, his son-in-law bought him a set of paints and Nick took off with that and painted scores and scores of paintings that uh, depict Grandview here, of course, in his life here, but also his life before he moved here. And he was a world traveler. So there's uh, pictures of all kinds of different places. He actually entered in the early 50s, one of his paintings uh, just dabbling around uh, in uh, state fair for adults and won a gold ribbon. And that was a big thing. Oh, gold ribbon. We got a picture of it someplace. But uh, Nick was an artist, and that's his way of speaking to people. Still, even though he's passed away.